here, Thibodeau. Look at this, sugar canes. Just imagine what our people went through. Just imagine. Wow, guys. Oh, this is our history. It's not the future. This is definitely part of the past, guys, but look at this. Hi guys, it's your girl Lemmy. What's good guys, your boy Slim Weed. And we're here in Thibodeau, Louisiana. Guys, we at the Laura Valley Plantation. We're about to do a quick little vlog. Hopefully, you know, this is educational for you guys. Hopefully it's educational for us, but let's see what Laura Valley um, was about and what the history of our people went through at this plantation, guys. So don't go anywhere, me and I, historical trip. Let's go. Wow, guys. So uh, Tucker holds on to it until the he, he Union Army came through in 1863. They did what all conquering armies do. They picked up everything worth anything and walked off it. Uh, so they, they took a million pounds of sugar, a million pounds of molasses, all the sugar molasses that was in the lab, 300 mules, uh, all the wagons, all the there are eight double houses. There's eight of these three repeats. Mm -hmm. We believe that the original eight double houses are attached to the back of these three repeats. Yeah, my grandma had houses look like these. Really, me? Because there is no money that comes in from it. Established, um, you know, fifty to a hundred years before the Lord. Many original buildings in the original location. Oh, gotcha. So, any other plantation you go to where you see a bunch of old buildings, they're either going to be fake buildings or real buildings that were moved there to that location, not in their original location. So all these houses are pretty much aside from the Ray Charles house. Uh, all these houses are original buildings in their original location. Look how similar it is to that one. I can't do that anymore. Hmm. Uh, but this one's very similar to the others. It's slightly different in the movie Ray, not the real. Yeah, movie. yeah, yeah. I know. I, we we went to. Yeah. We went to. Yeah. Maybe we can insert the scene. Ray, come on in for dinner. And stop rubbing those eyes. Ain't nobody gonna have no pity on you just cause you're going blind. Now wipe them eyes. Yes, sir. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, would have would have been featured in that.
and this one had a screen door. Oh yeah. So these, so these were built around 1915. Yeah, well, they were still kind of scaling up, trying to, trying to upgrade for the mill. Um, but these are actually the, the fanciest. They've got uh, basically a, a big double on the front. All right, y'all. And this is the schoolhouse. Uh, they said this is first through seventh grade. The rest of the time, he was working. Because of the storm, but y'all can see the school desk, chairs in there. And y'all can see inside. Our house. All right, guys. So that is the tour. Again, we couldn't really get record them speaking because it's a private tour. But man, it's history. Mm -hmm. uh, a lot, of, a lot of new key points. It wasn't just black slave, of course. Um, this is kind of almost, well, it was post-slavery. Uh, a lot of people uh, were workers, freemen, sharecroppers. Uh, they had um, on record Chinese, uh, people from the Caribbeans, um, Germans. Um, that's here working, of course, for, for low wages. So it wasn't just um, slaves, but again, majority of the work came from the sweat of, of, of African people. Um, but I me, mean, what you think about it, the tour, babe? I think it Y'all can kind of see still behind us. I tried to, we tried to gather as much information as possible. We had, um, it was, it was cool. Like I, we, I kind of wish I could have just got more into it, like the buildings, but of course they, some of them are bar barely standing. So, you know, uh, only one has really been, um, re, what you call it, remodeled. What, um, I guess you could say, and that was the one with, uh, what was it? Jamie Foxx. What was the movie? Ray, uh, Ray. Ray. So, so again, everything is pretty much as is. Now, a lot of these properties, of course, uh, was handmade. Mm -hmm. So they didn't have nails. I forgot the way they said they put these uh, properties like together. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, th so a lot of them, because they wanted to of course make it safe mm -hmm. so a lot of the properties uh were nailed together but they're as is they just been refurbished i guess you can say and you may see some that were actually torn down i was like what are y'all gonna do with them so they try to uh i guess save as much lumber as they can so they'll keep the lumber or so all these probably were the original uh uh slave quarters except for the one that right. jamie fox was that they use for the movie Ray, they had to real build that. But so everything else is as is. Again, they've they been modified, refurbished, keep it, keep yeah. it up. Uh, so we couldn't go inside of them, of course. A lot of these properties were are still kind of damaged through, of course, Katrina and now Ida. Yeah. So we couldn't go as close as we want to, like some other YouTube video were. But still, we got oh. close enough. Um, of course, you hear music playing in the background because we couldn't put them talking. Right. I mean, I think you got this on cinematic mode, baby. So that's why you oh, keep no. coming glare in. Now you did oh, it on purpose. Me, no, I did. Let me see. Let me focus, focus, focus. But overall, guys, but, man, um, I hope y'all get inspired by this. Yeah. Uh, again, our people went through so much. Uh, of course, y'all know this, man. This is not something to preach on, but y'all know our people went through so much, man. And for them to go through, and for them to go through what they went through, guys, there's no excuse in 2021 for you to make excuses. There's nope. nothing that you should say of an excuse to why you're not at to where you should be or need to be guys because these people here no sit still. they no ain't had no still. excuse they had to work put in work take care of their families go to school get beat hung killed work 24 hours a day seven days a week no shower so there's no excuse guys for you to they had to make it work for they had to make it they work had. they work with what they had all they had. and they just said like a lot of these people and i i also didn't know a lot of these uh slave quarters were like a little mini apartments mm -hmm. In the course of the 1800, 1900s, they had their own gates, picket fences. Um, they had each quarter had their own outhouse. 
Um, and but because they were still slaves or they were working for slave labor, the slave master or the owners of the property did very little for them. So they really had to make it work with whatever they had because again, technically slavery was nowhere. They was working. They got paid very little, mm -hmm. but they had to make it work. So hey, hold on, huh? Hence, hence why. Like, I, I, don't want to, I hate when people eat chitlins and stuff like, oh, they're going to get on me. Eat chitlins because, again, that's the type of stuff that they had to eat because they had to make the scraps work. So, again, guys, like, there's no excuses. The bathroom they had, they but said But then was, maybe you should look at it like that, though. Okay? So maybe some people still eat in that manner because they don't they don't have a lot. Like, no, just, baby, saying, ain't no excuse right, to eat chitlins in 2021. Let me also say this. Do you guess what, y'all? The most recent uh, resident, it was like uh, 20... In the 2000s, they didn't move out to 2000. So somebody lived out here. Yeah, the one of the tour city. guys, uh, yeah. Tammy, her mother, her mother-in-law lived in one. Of, yeah, she said the third. Was, she was pointing over here somewhere. One of these was living here until like 40 years ago. So, God, the, people were still living in these slave quarters up until um, the plant. They said this plant. This used to be a steel, the steel plant. Uh, or steam, uh, where they make steel. Uh, steam, 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 steam. I hear it was working until the 1920s, but people were still living. The lady that gave a tour said that her mother-in-law never left this property until she got married. And she left this property. How, she, how long ago, me? Uh, I don't know. No, she said her mother-in-law, her mother-in-law was living up until, until she got married. Until she got married, she was living in this property up until maybe 30, 40 years ago. That's oh, my phone. Look, oh, look. So Oh, that's a, my phone, <laughs> YouTube oh. video. But guys, man, uh, I, I hope y'all come here. Technically, me, what you said, this is not Thibodeau. This was this called. This is this is Lafouche, Lafouche Parish. Pa uh, Lafouche Parish. But now we may also insert us just riding through some more uh, parishes or more slave. We gonna slave try houses. to, man. We but try. I don't know. It might be. I'm slavery full now, right. man. Look, my spirit. My over, spirit. I'm out. My I'm out. Done. My spirit, my spirit can't can, can take too much yeah. more of this, guys. But uh, it's just, a, it's just, it's, it's maybe we'll nice. come through again with some of you guys. Y'all want to come through Thibodeau's again? It's about an hour outside New Orleans, but we here, guys. Laura Valley Plantations, man. So it's, it's a weird feeling, man. Like it's so quiet out here. He said, you "No, know, there's YouTube videos that it's ghosts out here." I mean, I do believe in spirits. You no, know, our ancestors still trying to get a word in but it's like right there look look me it's super quiet it's weird but uh no excuse guys no excuse make it happen fulfill y'all dreams fill y'all goals i'm inspired hope you guys are inspired trying to give y'all a little extra views of the slave quarters behind us All right, guys, so I hope y'all like this video. No, we hope you love this video. Y'all make sure y'all subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, that yeah. thing, so you can stay notified whenever we drop new content. Guys, y'all make sure y'all follow us on our social media platforms. We have time. me and I365. We got our business Instagram, which is Shop MAI Nutrition. And then we got business website. Me, tell the website, baby. It is shopmainutrition.com. Again, it is shopmainutrition.com. Y'all see it? Y'all get the God First. This is a puff material. This is God First and puff material. Guys, we got supplements and uh content created guys so go check out our website go support us uh, uh this is laurel valley plantation here in louisiana our outside montgomery, not montgomery yeah. outside new orleans yeah. guys we about to go get something to eat man y'all make sure y'all uh let us know what y'all think you got a place that y'all want to go see and visit put that in the comments below and uh again we love y'all thank y'all so much for rocking with us go check out the next video in our new orleans series and we out Bye.